Hello! How's it going, guys? <laughs> um, Alright. First off, how are the audio levels doing right now? I've done some messing around with it. I'm probably a lot louder than I was. Not sure if it's too high, if I need to turn it down, if the desktop audio needs to shift. Audio seems fine. Cool, 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 cool. Success! <laughs> All right, cool, cool, cool. All right, we've got two goods. I'm going forward. <laughs> All right, so basically the plan today is I need enchantments, right? But I don't have any cows in the area near my survive island that I'm on right now. So we're gonna go find some and cart them like a thousand blocks through the ocean. <laughs> um, so it should be interesting. And we'll see how it goes. And also, as you can probably see, I've added a little message up here. As like my little my little attempt at advertising, if anyone drops in who doesn't know me. <laughs> uh, so we'll see how that works out. Anyway. Uh, we shall actually play the game now. Woo. Minecraft. All right. So, it's, oh wait, wait, wait. Uh, I forgot. Yes, that's fine. Brightness up. I was like, why is it so dark in here? <laughs> the brightness was down. All right. So, um. All right, cows. We're going to need boat. Well, first off, we should figure out where we're putting them, actually, before I cart them all the way over. So... Where do we want to put them? I don't want them too close to the house, because they're going to be loud. Uh, I could... So options are chop some trees down over here somewhere. And... Make a spot. Or... If we go this way, 
There's just kind of natural little hole here. I kind of like it though, I don't really want to break it. So I'm thinking I want to leave this one. I could go... All the way over here somewhere. Maybe get rid of some of the vines. Chop down some trees. Actually, this might be the best spot. Because fourth option was going to be all the way on that island. But that's a little far. So actually, this is probably a good area. For a cow pit. Uh, I should get an actual shovel before I do this. Anyway, how are you guys doing today? Chat of various origins. <laughs> Um, I'm doing good, if anyone cares. <laughs> um, went out and met some people and had lunch, which was cool. What am I doing? I'm making a shovel. So yeah, I actually went outside today. Beat you to it, doing well? Alright, good, good, good. I like to hear that. Um, yeah. Uh, how big do we want to make this? Well, we're only going to start with two cows, but there's going to be more eventually, so I might as well dig it out. Because basically, I need enchantments. Good enchantments, I need more books for both just enchanting the books and having bookshelves to make the enchantments stronger. In order to make books, I need sugarcane, which I have, and leather, which is not here. So, cows. Because I don't really want to go in the nether without enchantments, because I am not that great at the game. And while it would be fine, ultimately, I'll probably die a couple of times. I'm trying to avoid doing that. So... Um, I need ladders too. So that's what we're gonna do. Eggs. There's a couple. Ooh. Nothing. Uh... That was actually like the perfect number. I'm pretty sure I have four chickens in here. Oh, two of them are still babies, I think. Go, you're faster. All right, cool. More chickens. Because uh, right now I only have 15 arrows, so ultimately I would like to get some like feathers. Um, what am I doing? Ladders, ladders, that's what I was doing. I need more. Can you make sticks with different kinds of wood? Let's test this. You can, that's great. I'll just make a lot of sticks, they're useful. But I only need that many ladders. All right, so once I get this in, that's the pit sorted. <laughs> then we just have to go and hope I remember exactly the path that I took to find the cows previously. I'll just put... Sure. All right. So... Off we go. I always forget that the pressure plate's there. I don't always do that. So I always instinctively want to turn around and close it. Okay. So now, I need boats. Hey! Thanks for following, uh... Ijby something server? Hold on. I only need two boats. 
How you doing? Any point find people can you go? More in depth about you know, like explain mission. Alright, that's cool, that's cool. Um I didn't mean to make that one. <laughs> Uh, I will... Oh, I get it. LGBTQ server. Okay, I get it now. Uh, yeah, I'll think about it and maybe talk to you about it some more later. <laughs> we'll see. Um, yeah, but uh, hope your day's going well. Thanks for following and hanging out for a little bit, maybe. Uh, yeah. Uh, what was I doing? Cows, boats. I keep getting distracted today. Fair warning. For those who haven't noticed, I had caffeine earlier today. <laughs> so I'm a little bit more hyper than usual, probably, even. And just streaming tends to make me more rambly than usual in general. So, okay. Wheat for luring, boats for catching them. Uh, I'll get two. I'll have to make two trips to bring them both over because I don't have any leads to, like, drag one after me in the boat. Um... Okay, I think that's good. Now I just have to hope I don't get lost on the way there. Oh, I already made a boat too. Okay, well we just have a lot of boats now. Alright. So, just to remind myself, it's about 100x and 50y. And off we go. Okay. So if I remember right, it's about this way. We kind of went around the island and then we went to the right because basically what i know of my world right now there's a giant jungle here that stretches ages in that direction like i was gonna go and try and go around it all the way once and it was just huge so i gave up and then this mesa biome goes a long ways in that direction and eventually leads to like kind of a plains and um there's a desert in this direction and there was a acacia biome over there as well so I have some acacia wood, as you may have noticed earlier. And that's it so far. I found a couple villages as well. So eventually we're also going to be carting villagers. But for now... I just want to get the cows, because that's my main limiting thing. But villagers will be nice to get, you know, better books and emeralds for trading. And uh, it'll be a faster way to get diamond armor if I get like a... What are they called? Blacksmith villager? And max him out and they have the diamond armor i'm pretty sure it's just in this general direction we're just gonna go and hope i end up there why cows because i need leather in order to make bookshelves in order to like enchant things and yeah and also just they're a pretty good source of food because the potatoes again i have my nice potato farm right now and that's feeding me but ultimately i can just eat beef the saturation's a little bit better. And then the uh, potatoes can be traded to villagers and get emeralds that way. Um, the best ways that I know for emeralds is either farmer villagers. Oh, I still have... Hmm. All right, well, it's too late to go back now. It's dawned on me that I had an extra bed that I made last time I was wandering around and I didn't bring it with me because I just kind of left without thinking. So we'll hope that that's not a problem. Oh, I see shore. Is this the shore I want? Where is this? What? Oh, there's a trident dude. Where Where are you? I, I want your trident. Oh, oh, he broke my boat. Okay, let's hope I just don't die here because these guys hurt a lot. I'm going to keep moving. Ow. That wasn't very nice. Drop your trident. I need to go up. This guy surprised me. <laughs> trident dude. No, ow. You're not very nice. Okay. I need to get directly above him. I can't... Oh shoot, 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 oh shoot. No! Up. Oh! Alright. Um. Okay, so... I'm gonna sleep, get rid of mobs. I know the general direction I went in. I have an extra boat already, so that's convenient. I'll actually grab the bed this time, which is here. I have extra bread. Okay, I'll make another ax. Do I have more sticks in here somewhere? 
Uh, I can make more. Oh, there's a zombie somewhere. That's cool. Well, he can't get to me because it's daytime now. Make a new axe and a new shield, actually, now that I'm thinking about it, because that's kind of what killed me there. Uh, wood. So yeah, um, for those who haven't seen all the videos, that is officially my third death on this world. The first of which happened... Oh, someone's burning. The two of them both happened. They both happened the first day. That's what I was going for. Uh, what was it? One of which was when I dropped down in the cave for the first time, like right over there. And there was like two baby zombies, a couple of big zombies, and a skeleton. And I had no armor and no weapons that were anything better than stone, because that's why I was going in the cave in the first place, and died. The second death was about right over here, when I was first building this farm and a creeper dropped down from up there on top of me and blew up instantly, and I died. And now my third death was to this drowned, so that's nice. Okay, so we are going to speed back to roughly where I was and hope I can find the area I was roughly in in the open ocean and get my things back. <laughs> Cause like, I think I have, I mean, I have plenty of iron enough to replace the stuff, but I'd prefer not to. Just cause I know iron gets drained a lot later when you do, you know, uh, what's it, redstone and stuff. And you have like the hoppers and their, I think repeaters might use iron. No, I think that's just stone, but yeah, I'm trying to avoid that. Um, I forgot the impaling dudes are painful. <laughs> and he might still be here. I'm not sure if he despawns when I go into a different area or not. Hmm. Okay. I feel like... Is it more this way? Somewhere around here. I know we started seeing land in this direction. Come on. That's fish. The items will float up to the top. Um. Okay, it was over here. There we go, there we go, I see it. My stuff! Is this dude still here? We'll find out in a moment. Give me my things, please. I would like to not be running around without anything. Okay, well, he seems to be gone as well. So I guess they do despawn. I could get out of the boat and make this a little faster, but we're just gonna not do that, I guess. Okay. Uh, that's all my armor. I have two axes now. A lot of boats. Problem solved, I did bring the bed now. Okay. Anyway. We'll pretend like that never happened. <laughs> Okay, so this is the desert. That's a, um, like, savanna thing, or I think so. Yes, yes, acacia. That's what it is. And I believe there were cows over here. So if my memory doesn't fail me. And there's like, two villages. Oh, there's a cow. Perfect. There's, like, two villages that I found so far in this desert. And that desert temple, I think, is the one I already saw, but I'll check it before I get the cows, actually. Just to make sure. Yes, okay. Faster. Right. <laughs> um, Because I'm pretty sure this would be the one that I found last time I came out here. Because this looks like the same area I was in, but I'll check. Yes, it is. All right.
Okay. So I can't put both cows in one boat. So I'll get one at a time. That was weird. Actually, back up. Boat. Got to eat food. And wheat for a cow. Hello, friend. Come here. This is a totally good thing you want to come with. Get in the boat. There we go. Cow number one. And now we go all the way back. Uh, pop up coordinates just in case I get lost. And now we go back. They're both going down. Okay. Also, I should be looking down to see if I see shipwrecks or something. Um, because I have an idea for a base in the future, but oh, oh shoot! Did I just check something in the water? I don't think so. I think I was. Oh, Was someone shooting at me? I heard... Um... Cow is really blocking my vision here. <laughs> like, it's like half cow. Um... So like, if the H... Oh, that's advanced tool tips. Uh, actually, I'll leave that on. Uh, F3G is blocks. F, that's reload. Uh, jump back. Okay. We'll just pretend I wasn't. I'll look it up later. There's a way you can pop it up where it shows entities on the screen and it's easier to like, find things. But I forget what the keybind is for it, so we're just gonna not do that. Oh, wait, I'm going in the wrong direction. Um, this way. There we go. And it should be just like around this bend. Oh yeah, once we are by the house, I can show you guys who haven't been here the turtle fens. If they're assuming that they haven't left their island, they might have. Uh, are they here? No. It's this over there more. Oh, yeah. uh, so that's where the first cave is that we went down. Where I got a vast majority, like at least half of the iron that I have now. Hitbox is F3B. Okay. And it was F3 something. Yeah, there we go. Okay. I always have to look them up. I forget. <laughs> I like having the tooltips on so I can tell durability, but the others I usually do not. Alright, Mr. Cow, we're back. Oh wait, I was gonna look at the turtles. There they are. Uh, are all four of them? There are four here right now. Ooh, wait. I don't want to park the boat right next to them because they'll get in the boat and I won't be able to get in the boat unless I kill someone and it will be sad. Turn that off. So yeah, there's only three of them now. I think there used to be like four or five here. At least four. But yeah. They're just chilling here. Occasionally one of them slips into the water and disappears forever. But yeah, our little turtle friends. If we want to get like a turtle helmet or something in the future, they're around. Alright, uh, it's getting dark, so let's get Mr. Cow in a bed, or in, not in a bed, <laughs> in his new home. 
and then I'll get in a bed and then go back for the next one. Go back. This is close as we can get. Come on. There it goes. You come in here. Perfect. Actually, I'm gonna light up this area now I'm thinking about it. Um, there you go. You're perfectly safe in there. <laughs> the bad thing about jungles is there's lots of places for things to like hide, which scares me a little bit. But I'm starting to light up this area pretty well. I say as a creeper is right there. Yeah, target practice. Not like there here until he stops moving. Eh, okay, I could go a little higher though. Oh. Higher. Okay. Yeah, he's gone. Okay, we'll just run over and hit him. Because I'm going to pick up those arrows. I don't have that many right now. Come here. There we go. And gunpowder for future TNT or rockets if I get... When I get an elytra, because I will eventually. That is one of the end goals here. Oh, I actually have a lot now. Oh yeah, I forgot about that book. Mmm, okay, sleep, and then another cow. Doo -doo -doo. How's my farm doing while I'm here? Okay, I'll harvest those when I get back. The glowberries are doing their thing. Skeleton. Uh, it's like right oh there we go cool the globally is actually like really nice like in the jungle the vines are more annoying but like these these are cool i don't know how long i'm gonna let them go I'm not fell in the water but yeah they look cool all right back for cow number two Oh, see, there's one of the turtles. Alright. All of Driver Cat's songs are just awesome. I don't know. I like all of them. Some admittedly a little more than others, but all of them are good bops. There was a drowned over there. I think he didn't have the trident though. So we'll not worry about that. But yeah, oh, I remember what I was talking about now earlier. I have an idea for a future base once I get more things and have time to focus on building like a big base. Um, that revolves a lot around um, the axolotls because they're adorable and I love them and want a lot of them. So that will happen at some point. Uh, I don't know how much I want to say about it right now because there's not really a point, but it's not going to really be a thing until I get, um, ideally, depending on if I build it, this is kind of a hint, if I build it underwater or overwater, 
Um, which I could go either way right now. But if it's going underwater, I need a... What is it? Those things you can put underwater and like breathe infinitely. The conduits. I'd like to get a conduit if that's the case. Uh, obviously, I haven't found any actual axolotls yet, so I would need those just for the aesthetic. Uh, lots of glass. So probably with like shulker boxes, which is again why I'm not doing it now. So it's like an after the end realm thing. Beacon could be nice for getting the sand purposes, which would require wither, but I could just efficiency through it. It's not like it takes that long to mine sand as is. <laughs> With efficiency five, it's basically instant mining it anyway. Um, so yeah, that's your little hint towards that for those who I haven't mentioned it to yet, but it should be really cool. It's kind of not as functional and a little bit more like for fun. So yeah. I mean it'll look cool is my end goal. Yeah. Alright. We're going back. I haven't actually been looking at coordinates, so we need to go more this way. Yeah, it's around this corner. Alright. Uh, sad ghost bear song is sad. Ooh, that's an underwater ravine. Uh, we'll come back there in a second, actually. There could be axolotls down there, and I want to know if they are. Because axolotls for the win. But yeah, I really want to get a blue axolotl as well, specifically. And because blue is like my favorite color, generally speaking. I like a lot of colors, but I just usually say blue is my favorite. Because there's a lot of different shades of blue that I like. And of course the blue axolotls are the super rare ones, which also makes it kind of fun. It's like a challenge thing to go through. So. Yeah, eventually we're going to get a blue axolotl. Which probably is going to require getting a lot of axolotls because... Oh, I overshot it again. Because you can get them by just finding one, which is like a really, really rare chance. Or each time you breed two axolotls of any color, there's like a chance to get a blue one. No matter what color the parents are. So. Haha, -ha, cows. Uh, I'll be right back with more wheat for you guys. So, basically I'm going to end up with a lot of axolotls probably. Before I get my blue one. And then the blue one is going to probably get like a little special enclosure thing. Okay. Um, also, just in case I ever find one, I'm going to get another bucket. That's not what I meant to do. Oh, my torch! Okay. Farming... We are going to farm, and then we are going to go investigate that ravine in hope of axolotl. It's hard to judge which potatoes are tall enough. I'm not going to cook any of these yet either because I don't really need them. And again, it might be better to save them for future trading stuff. Alright. Yeah, but you just... I feel like potatoes are the best if you're doing crop food other than, like, golden carrots. I feel like potatoes are the easiest to get. Just because of how many 
you drop. Like, this wasn't even like a full 9x9 nine nine of potatoes. And I have a lot of them. And a poison potato. Uh, seeds. I'll take a pumpkin. I don't know what I'm gonna do with the pumpkins, but I'll have them. I could do jack-o'-lantern lighting, that could be cool. Do I have more wheat? Anywhere? No, I turned it all on the bread. Okay, well. I only need two right now, because I have two cows. The cow army begins. Every few minutes, I'll have to remember to come over and make a baby. Oh, wait, I want the experience actually. Oh, I just realized too when I died, I lost all that experience. Oh, that sucks. I was like at level 20, I think. I can turn that off. <laughs> Gosh dang it. There it goes. Ooh, wow. Lots of eggs. Oh, I'm sorry. Ooh. Yeah. With each chicken you gain and this kind of thing, you just get exponentially more eggs, and it's kind of crazy. <laughs> but I'll have a lot of feathers and stuff soon, hopefully. Okay. Um, next, since, well, actually, wait, no. Well, it's getting nighttime. Uh, I am going to grow more wheat so that it goes faster. For the cows. I'll start with the ones that are already almost grown. For sake of conserving. I got a melon too. Again, it's kind of weird because it's, like, it's not like I really need the melons at the moment. I guess eventually, uh, I think regen potions you need them, right? But for now, they're just kind of. I only have two of them. I have two melons and three pumpkins at the moment. But I'll take some. If I ever need them, I'll have them. I should just bring this whole thing down a layer. I don't need it as high. Oh. Um. Okay, you guys better not escape. Oh, little baby chicken, why'd you do that? Oh wait, you might go back with your parents since you're a baby. I might be able to save you. What little baby chicken. Okay, you need to go around this way. What what are you, what are you doing? Okay, I need a seed. To help this idiot. <laughs> oh, that's a zombie sound. Hello, seeds. There we go. That's a dark spot right next to the cows. Okay. There we go. Little baby chicken. Come here. Up. Oh. And then push you back in. No! Okay, well, at least you're coming back here on your own. There you go. <laughs> All right. Problem solved. I should put... Didn't I have another ladder? I could go steal a ladder from the cow farm and put one in here. Would they be able to escape if I put a ladder there?
I could put a trap door there. I don't know if... Or I could just, like, not fall in. That's probably a better idea. Okay. Anyway, there's lots of scary things spawning here. So I am just going to go and sleep away the night. Do -do -do. And now you're on fire. I'll kill you for the experience. Cool. Oh wait, I need my shield back. Ha! Perfect time. Oh, turtle, hello! Death. It's too bad we can't pick up skeleton arrows. Oh, there's another one. Hello, friend. You die as well. Alright. And this is why I really don't particularly enjoy living here. There's too many spots where things spawn and then don't die. The sword's about to break. Yeah, there it goes. Oh, he... Okay. I won't make another sword for now. I'll just go with the axe since I have two of them. Less swinging damage, more crit chance, I think, or with players it might just be disabling shields. Uh, I'm not really a PvP expert, so I can't say for sure, but yeah. Whoa. That was weird. I held down the E key there, I think. Okay, so I think what I'm going to do, while I'm waiting for the cows to let me do their thing, I want to build the kind of a second floor of this building. Expand my house out more. Okay, let me think about this. Because this is... This wall, eventually. Uh, these are all going to be gone. These are all going to be moved. This won't stay here at all. And this is just going to be like all storage stuff. Uh, I might leave the crafting table. Or stick it in the floor. So this will be all storage. And then upstairs is where I'm going to have like a bed. And uh, the enchantment room will be up there in one of the corners. Um, actually, the furnaces will probably stay. My bit rate's kind of like randomly dropping. Okay. Gotta love sketchy internet. Okay. So yeah, that is the plan ultimately, which means I need to tear out part of the roof. Actually, I don't need to tear out the roof, I just need to get up on top of it. So, okay, I need cobblestone, more slabs I already have. Uh, do -do -do. I'll store you here. Along with all the extra potatoes. I don't need the bed. I keep getting bows from skeletons. I don't know how. Well, I mean, I know how, but like the drop rates are higher than I feel like they used to be. Okay, so cobblestone. Do I have extra windows? I do. I'll do that later once I know how many I need. The posts are oak, so I don't have that much of it. So first step, more oak. I'll go down a bit, so it's not right next to my house where I'm tearing it out. This is a nice tall tree. There's like a balance where you can stick your head above water and keep swimming. It's hard to maintain. Well, that's kind of a... I'll go for this tree. I don't like tearing down like the super fancy trees. 
Partially because they're annoying and partially because they look cool. This one's not that fancy, it can go. Is there any more logs I need to worry about? No. Okay. I should probably start like a proper oak farm by where my house is. That would probably be smart. Because generally it's going to be used a lot more than the jungle is. Because part of the problem is, I know eventually I'm going to have to go on a mission against all of the like big jungle trees. There's all the jungle trees in general around where my house is. Because them being there is just kind of annoying in general. For a lot of reasons. So I need to clear out a nice area for that. But then I'm going to end up with a lot of jungle wood. <laughs> and also it's going to go through a lot of axes if I don't have efficiency for unbreaking. Unbreaking more than efficiency. So that's... Not gonna happen quite yet, but like, these ones over here, these ones back here, my mine entrance is back there, so like all of these will probably have to go. That one up there is annoying. For example, ooh, a lot of glowberry. They're getting really long. I'm not sure what they're gonna do when they hit where the crops are like we'll see if this one grows another block down or if it's annoying that it's this block down i could put like string across here to keep it from growing i think we'll see i'll let the eggs grow more uh i could have a sugar cane Might as well plant more of these, just speed up the process. That's fine. I might as well take some of these out. Because bamboo good for both scaffolding and um when i get my villagers and you get a fletcher you can turn bamboo into sticks instead of chopping down a bajillion trees so bamboo farm i could make it bigger but i don't really want to right now so we're just stockpile like that gave me almost three stacks Uh, just a little bit of organization. Once all this stuff is gone, I'm gonna actually organize chests. Because that'll look nicer. Okay. What was I doing earlier? Okay. Wood. I got wood. For sake of bed. Where do- I guess the ladder up will go here. So I should make the ladders. Didn't I? I know I used all three of them. Ladder. Which will go up to this floor. Make it taller. Um. Oh, that's annoying. How are we gonna do this? So that it doesn't... These blocks are gonna have to turn into full blocks on the inside. Is what's gonna have to happen here. Um, and this might become oak. I can make this window slightly smaller. I guess it's a pain to break the glass. I think that's what's gonna have to happen. 
mean, I could see what it looks like with just... Mm. Nah, I'll do this. It makes the door center with that. So I suppose this is fine. I could put... Eh, we'll think about it. For that, it's good. Night time again. In a second. Come on. Come on. There we go. I'm just kind of paranoid about making sure I sleep every night because phantoms will spawn. And they scare me. Okay. So that's where the floor is going to be is this block. And then one, two, three... I'll start with three. I might make this floor extra tall. So now there's a question before I start going and chopping down more wood for this. How do I want- I could make this... I think I'll put oak logs across here and here in the ceiling. On the bottom it'll look flat. And on the top all of this is going to be up a block. So it's gonna be like here. Oh, that's actually not where it's going to be. I take that back. Right here. And right here. So now, bones and oak saplings to grow more oak trees. I'm going to grab wheat for cows. Go over there, do that real quick, then start growing trees. And chopping them down. Alright, we've now doubled our cow population, so that's cool. I don't need this anymore. Uh, eggs, might as well. Oh, sorry. There we go. I think this is enough space for oak trees. Yes. I should make a hoe to break the leaves faster. Just a stone one. I'll make two because they break fast. Ready? Watch this. Uh, it's not quite as fast. When you get like an iron one or better, it tears through them really fast, but it's still faster than 
fist slightly. So I'll take it. I mean, shears like instant mine them, but then I'm not getting saplings, I'm just getting blocks. So we're not gonna. Whoa! Hi there. Alright. So what are you guys up to this evening? Um, for those of you in America, I know it's like 4th of July weekend. I'm actually surprised I'm not hearing more fireworks right now. My neighborhood tends to not like to follow the rules with that kind of stuff. I'll do one more. So usually this fireworks early. I heard some like sparkling earlier, like the little sparkler ones, but I haven't heard any like big ones, which are extra illegal because we're not supposed to have those anyway, unless you're like licensed to use them. And you're definitely not supposed to be lighting them off in a neighborhood because fire, but they do it anyway. And then my poor dog gets really scared. She doesn't like them. She gets super like she is. She gets super anxious with loud noises like that. Any big boom sound, she just does not like. Even though like, it's not like. Oh, I mean, yeah, it's just like an instinctual fear. Upsetty spaghetti pepperino. Exactly, exactly. That's exactly what it is. And like, there's no way it's good for her to get that anxious. Like, it can't be good for, like, her heart, even. <laughs> it's so, so bad. Um, so, I mean, we do have, like, you know, anxiety medication for when we realized, like, how bad it was for her. That we're going to be trying to give her. And hopefully it doesn't make her sick, because sometimes... She has a bit of a sensitive stomach, but usually not as much anymore. When she was younger, she did, but that might also just be because she ate whatever she found in the backyard. <laughs> so, oh, I'm just going to be a couple short, aren't I? Yep. That's fine. Now, do I want to replace these with blocks? Yes, yes, I'm going to do that. And then... These will just become the new roof. So I'll just break all these. So slow. It's fine. Oop, bed. No fall damage. Gaming. Okay. Uh, I can just... Well, I need more oak. Either way, so I'll just... Do that in a second, actually. Actually, that all needs to stay open. trees. I could plant multiple of them side by side. I'll do that later. 
now since I'm growing them, it's not really a point. I'm doing like maximum efficiency. And also, I'll just do this till I get more saplings than I started with. I would like to go like three more trees just to make sure I have enough in case I want to make the next floor like one taller because I'm thinking I might just do that drop a sapling okay got one I think you can stay there let's finish this I'm gonna want another ladder there as well It's a traitor dude. Hello, Finn. Do you have anything good? Not really. I'll let you guys decide this chat. Do we murder him? Because usually, typically with these dudes, since the trades aren't great, and I don't really have need for him at all right now, the, the play is you murder this dude and take the leads. <laughs> so. A quick poll. Murder or no murder? Murder? All right. Uh, see, the funny thing is after I do this, the llamas are going to be mad at me too. I could try... Okay, wait, before I do that. We'll go back to him in a second. I need four. I make... A fence post for them. Just to leash them too. Because they'll despawn if they're not tied to something. I learned. Alright. Eat before I do this. They don't really do that much damage, but I'm just scared. Alright, he's dead. Give me your leads, please. Oh, come back. You're hitting each other with this. Come on. No, don't hit each other. Stop being mad at me. Yeah, I think if I go away and come back, they'll not be mad at me. So we're just gonna go over here. I mean, I probably have to despawn them, actually, so... I don't have the boat on me anymore. Okay. Well, we'll see... if just coming over this way. Because I'd like them to not be... spitting at me while I'm... trying to build. Ideally. Good excuse to explore this way a little bit for a second. Yeah. This jungle definitely just kind of keeps going. In this direction. I'm not quite for sure for how long. That's about as far as I've been. 
I think it goes longer, considering the tree. Anyway, I don't really feel like going that far. Swim! Once I get Depth Strider, it will be very nice to swim faster. Because I feel so slow right now. Doing. I can probably make more of them. Cause it's kind of the priority today, really, is getting leather. Oh yeah, you're still mad. Stop it. Are you gonna try and shoot at me through the door? No, you're not. <laughs> Suckers. Okay. The problem is with them mad at me like this. Is it worth saving? <laughs> They're cool because they the ones that spawn with those dudes have like the special clothes. And I know they eventually stop being mad because I've done this before. I could move them further away from me. Yeah, that's what I'll do. Just so they're not. Alright. You have to unleash them and then lead them back over here. Make both of them, please. Okay. Come on. Are you guys still mad? Oh, they stopped yelling at me. We're friends now. Hello guys. Well, you're over here. I guess. I'll light up this area a bit. I guess this is your home for now. Cool. Llamas. Might as well tame you. Yeah, now we're friends. Ooh, this guy's got 11 hearts. I wonder how much storage these dudes have. Hey, achievement! Because... Wait, do they both have 11? No, this guy only has 10. Ooh! Did the mic pick that up? <laughs> I don't know if that was loud enough to pick up. There was definitely a firework there. There we go. America. Anyway, now none of those guys won't be yelling at me while I'm... I need another ladder there. Okay, I will... I'm fixing that right now. That's annoying. Yeah. Ladder, and then I was gonna do the cows. Now that I'm thinking about it. Oh, I still have the wheat on me. That's useful. Yeah. Oh, the tree grew. I'll chop you down in a minute. This is a very sporadic <laughs> thing. I keep jumping around. Ooh. Explosions. But yeah. I'm not sure yet if you guys can hear them. I assume not, considering no one said anything. But... <laughs> they're, they're very loud enough that I can hear them through my headphones, which admittedly aren't soundproof. Oh, that was a sad tree. I'll come back to that in a minute to get saplings. I'll let it do its thing naturally. Alright. Building time, building time. Do, do, do. 
do. Which normally I wouldn't mind just leaving this on the inside, but since I'm going to be setting things on this, I can't. So we're just going to chop all this out and replace it with blocks. Haha, <laughs> we had another axe. <laughs> For no particular reason. <laughs> down here now. This is fine. There we go. Do I have- Yo, that was the perfect amount! Very cool, very cool. built this odd intentionally, I remember that much. <laughs> Next question before I sleep away the night. Do we want to make these all windows? <laughs> I mean, not all of them. This back corner won't be, but like this three sides, I'm thinking I might just do all windows. To look out over like, or at least these two. Look out over the ocean. It'll be nice. If I stay in this area for future base that I'm going to be building, it might be in the water there, if I'm going for the underwater version. Above land version, maybe over there somewhere? Or I might just go far away for it. Cause it's not necessarily a reason to stay around spawn forever. The reason I'm here is because sp I spawned like right over there. And I was like, yeah, jungle is good enough. But eventually I might move. That's a lot of eggs. Oh, I'm sorry, baby chicken. Oh, now you're out there. Okay. Oh no! Okay, I need to do this slower. Oh, there's a drowned there. Hi, dude. I'm gonna have to kill you. You won't just... And also you're coming to get me. 
Now you're dead. Baby chicken. Go on, you can find your own way back from here. I'll leave you to your devices. Either you make it back in or you don't, I suppose. Alright. Sleep. Everybody ever say no to you? Oh, did anybody ever say no to you? Wow. This is a cool song. Oh, there he goes. I got to see it happen, too. Zombie. Okay. What am I doing? House. House is what I'm doing. House. We got floor in. Ceiling. I think it's gonna go up one more, actually. Do I have the wood foot? One, two, three, four. Yes. Welcome back. That can leave now. I have to chop all these down in order to get up on top of them. Hi, why are you not there? There we go. Now he's dead. Hey, block clutch. Like all three of these windows, except for like the top. Actually, no way, even the top. Yeah, forget that. I'll go all the way up with them. Splurge a little bit, you know? The big windows look nice. And then back here, I will have enchanting. In my bed will be over here yes that is the plan same changing table is gonna go here i can move it up right now actually look at that okay so bookshelves are gonna be there so the chatty bowl needs to be boop right there yeah, so these two walls can definitely be a cobble. And this one will as well, but I'll get more first. Ah. I'm always mildly amused when like the super upbeat Undertale music like this comes on and I'm just like building. It's like, oh yeah. So intense. Place and blocks. I shouldn't have jumped there, I wouldn't take damage. Ooh. 
that's not too bad. I could make this more windowy as well, really, if I wanted to. I might later. All these are going to be windows. Which I know I have glass down here. And I'm going to need all of this. There it goes. That might be enough, actually. Probably not. I'm probably going to be disappointed. I'll just be really careful placing it. Windows. We finish this one. I'm just gonna be a little bit short. This is sad. This is sad. Actually, wait. Wait a minute. That was mean. I do have enough. Look at that. Hey! Oh, sticky keys. I need to turn that off later. But I don't really want to dig through settings when I'm live. So, we'll do that later. But yeah, cool view. Not really um any reason for this. It's just kind of cool, you know, the aesthetic. And this area will be enchanting, so that's cool. And that wall is gonna be chests, which actually means these windows need to go in the long run, because the chest will come out to here and it's weird to have a lock there. And I mean, I might move furnaces and stuff along this wall. So all of those might become wall as well. Then maybe this will be all windows or more windows than it is currently. But right now I only have five panes. So they're gonna wait. Okay. Back to cows. I should've eaten food. Cows. Nice. They're growing exponentially. Haha. -ha. Went out two, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. Seven cows. From the two we started with. Almost an hour and a half. Well, we didn't get them an hour and a half ago. We've been streaming for about an hour and a half. Almost. Maybe if I can go down more. Oh, there 
probably still spawn really high up. Okay. There we go. And I might as well get more wheat. There's no point not to get potatoes. Oh, I don't think that one is full good. That one's not. Those are... You gonna go? No. It's fine. Getting dark again. The glow berries are looking good. I'm just gonna leave them. Actually, do they actually glow? They do. I like that. That's cool. There it goes. Yeah, this tree needs to go. It's annoying. Alright. Look at that, they're all glowy and stuff. Eventually this will have more glowies too, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I like that, I like that. That's really, that's a good addition to the game. Alright. First night sleeping upstairs. Look at that. We're moving up in the world. Okay. And now I... We're going to try and be cool. Ah, I think I could do it. If I get out more. I'm not sure if this is actually possible. Ah, oh, I almost got it. I almost got it. I'm committed now. I hit it and hit shift maybe. No. Yes! <laughs> Look at that. I'm very cool. <laughs> Parkour. Woo. Alright, now we go across here. Hey, thank you. Sam gets it. <laughs> yeah. A lot of jumps are annoying sometimes. But I can show you the ones that really confuse me. Second, I'll finish this first. When I run out of slabs, I'll show you the jumps that are, in my opinion, the harder ones. That I've seen people do. I'm sure there are some that I just am not able to think of because I don't do that much parkour. I want to practice a little bit more. It seems really cool. 
and it's useful for just like kind of everything in general like even just building and stuff it's nice to be able to jump between things accurately and obviously in like pvp based stuff it's useful One, two, three, four, five. Oh wait, I was gonna leave this side open for sake of parkour and back up. Where's the ladder? This one has to break too. I'll do that last. set up a little example down here. I'll do it with dirt. Because I get distracted easily. Okay. The ones that are really hard, in my opinion, are when you have the block that you have to like go around. Actually, I should build this up one higher. So it's not cheatable. Question. Speed bridge. Answer? Uh, not really. I'm kind of practicing. I get the movement that you have to do, I just need to get used to doing it. For speed bridging. Anyway, so. Parkour jumps. We have a block like this directly in the way. You know, sort of anything on the side and you have to like get around it. Those are hard, in my opinion. You have to like, you have to like jump and like twist around weirdly. Cause it's kind of like you have momentum in the way that you're facing from my understanding. So you have to like, I did one once and I was very proud of myself. I know it's possible. I've seen it done. <laughs> I've done it once. I should get food. Um, nope. Yeah. Hey, there we go. Yeah, like that. It is possible. You just have to get like the angle perfect. And then what I've even seen done a couple of times is two blocks in a row of that. If you get like enough of a running start and the, like the movement's just right, which I've never done. I'll just try it. See, it's definitely possible. It's just hard. You have to like throw yourself around the edge. No, that was bad. Uh, no. Maybe it's a future stream where I just do parkour and get more and more frustrated. <laughs> uh, yeah, no. Okay, I'm, I'm not going to keep doing that. I was closest the first time, I think, ironically. But yeah. In my opinion, those are the hardest. Followed by the ladder jumps. Okay, I need more slabs. How many more slabs? A decent amount more slabs, okay. We'll do like 12 more worth. 16 more worth, that's gonna make like a stack if I remember right. Come on. There it goes. I just like yeeted one to the void. It's fine. That's way more than I need, but we'll 
go with it. I could place them from down here. I don't want to do this again. Ah. Forgot to hit shift. Okay. There we go. Just for funsies. Nice thing too that I did intentionally with this is that these are the, the bottom slabs. So nothing will spawn up there without lighting. And there we go. Uh, it is really dark here. Maybe I'll add more windows in the future, like here. Uh, this wall is going to have stuff on it, so it's not that necessary. I could like decorate up here, maybe in the future. Yeah, for now, it's just like this. The windows are very nice though. Natural lighting and all that. Okay. Now, I might as well. It's a... No, it's a, it's a bit. Move these. Okay, so all of this wall is gonna be chests. Except for actually. Actually, hold on. I've had a thought. If I make these top half slabs, it'll look the same on the top, but underneath I'll be able to open chests on the third level. Oh, my inventory is completely full. When did that happen? Uh, I had bones in these chests are a mess. I need to fix that at some point, which will be in a minute, actually, because I'm going to make a whole bunch of chests and then sort them. And eventually I'll also use the leather in order to label the chests. Or I could use signs. Especially if I get like lots of glue squid ink. And I can make glowy signs. That don't actually glow. As you do. Okay. Uh, poison potato, go away. I need to place this down. At least temporarily. I have a lot of these already so I don't need to make more. So I just do this. Uh, like so. If this is visible, I might even be able to make these um, stairs actually facing that way. I'm not sure how visible it will be once I get chests up. If I really hate it, I can do that. And then I should be able to still open the chests. And have three layers of them. Which is sweet. Okay. Next step. Lots of chests. I'm just gonna take all of these. I don't really care about keeping jungle wood. I'm gonna have to cut down a lot of it soon anyway. This is very dark. Cool. Uh, This is faster. Uh... There we go. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, I'm gonna make these stairs. Actually, I used all my jungle wood to make chests. I actually have to chop down more. Okay, well, this is an excuse to get rid of one of the trees in a second. Bed. Alright, cool. Ooh. Well, I had to come down here anyway. Alright, which tree will be our target? I could take out this big one. I could go up there and take out that one. Ooh, creeper! <laughs> Ooh, I'm glad I noticed him. Is he still following? Okay, good. Come over here. Well, there's not a bunch of things that will make me miss. Boop. Don't blow up, please. Boop. Alright. Whew. And that is exactly why we need to chop down more trees. Uh, there we go. See, I lit up a little bit up here after the one creeper, like, dive-bombed me. Kamikaze style, you know, as all creepers do, really. But it is not enough. Ooh. I could put down more chests. It's a little late for that now. We'll put them down in a minute. I'm gonna need a lot more chests anyway. Ooh, we got some Melahai going. From my playlist of things that probably won't get me <laughs> in trouble on Twitch. Ooh, that's a glitched, a glitched bean. I'll leave that for now. I okay, guess so that's those that are annoying. What other ones are hanging over the house right now? None from up here, I guess. Whoop. Okay, that's fine. This tree is probably the next most annoying. Those aren't going to despawn though, I don't think, on their own, but that's fine. short too short i take that back there we go all right did i pick up the wood that dropped over here i did not cocoa beans all right pit stop to go check on the cows How are you guys doing? Good? Okay, that's everyone. Beautiful, beautiful. These trees also need to go at some point. All, all the trees need to go at some point. Uh, this one in particular seems dangerous because they could... They can, I think, go up those. So I'm going to take this one down actually right now. There we go. That's the most dangerous one at least. These overhang a bit more. And I don't feel like chopping down giant tree right now. So that will wait. Do, do, do. So yeah, I don't know how many people are still hanging out at this point, but if you are, cool, good on you, keeping me company as I scramble around doing lots of random things. 
Um, if you're someone who is new, <laughs> this is also, I'm not used to advertising, eh, but <laughs> if you're someone who's like not been here before and you're not completely bored watching me, you know, you, you could hit the follow button and you'll get a cool thing on screen and all that. I don't know if there's even anyone here. I turn off my viewer account just so I don't think about it, as I've heard advised, which is probably good for me because that would just give me anxiety if I knew people were like leaving for some reason. But yeah, but that means I don't know if someone joined and I can't be like, yo, calling you out. Ooh, yeah, that looks good. That's really unnoticeable, actually. Okay, I like that. But yeah. But it's dawned on me. Yeah, I, it means I can't, like, notice when people are joining and try and, like, talk to them specifically and get to know whoever decide to drop by. So I need to get better, I feel like, it. just every once in a while mentioning... Like, hey, you could follow. And also, I have um, I have a Twitter, if people don't know that. So you could... That should be linked below the stream if you're on... What is it? If you're on, like, desktop, web browser. I know a lot of times I listen to streams on mobile. So with you, you'd have to, like, maneuver awkwardly to my page to see... Yeah, plug myself, thank you. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, somewhere around on Twitch you can find the link to my twit or my Twitter, I should say. And right now it's mostly just there's a cat there. I want the cat. I want the cat. Completely distracted off topic from what I was talking about, but I want the cat. Come here, kitty. Hi. You're gonna have to jump down from there. Is that If I jump up here, is that fine? So I can reach you. Hi. Hi, cat. No, 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 don't run away. Oh, there you go. Now you're on the floor. I can follow you. Okay. Space. Now I follow. Ah, oh, dang it. Come here. Okay. You can still tame them this way, right? Can you not? Can you not? Can you not tame wild ocelots anymore? I thought you could still do both. <laughs> no, I just fed this dude like four fish for no reason. Okay, fine. Go away. I don't want to see you anymore. I'll have to go to the village to get cats. <laughs> That's a lot of squid. Oh my gosh, dang it. Now I'm sad. But yeah, cats are good because they scare away creepers, which is kind of nice. So I'll have to do that at some point. Uh, oh yeah, I was going to go look in that ravine to see if there's axolotl. Because it seems like a good spot for them to spawn. Uh, actually, I know I have some doors sitting in here. I'm going to bring those for breathing purposes. Uh, seeds. Set all this stuff down. Uh, smoker. That connect it does that's fine i'll deal with that later all right anyway as i was mentioning uh the twitter exists i don't really post on it that much right now and it looks like really plain i don't have like a banner plain i don't really have like a banner or anything on it because i haven't got around to like trying to mess around and make one yet 
but eventually I plan to like post more like random stuff on there just about like what I'm doing or if I think of something funny as people do on Twitter I guess I don't know I haven't been on there that long so you could go follow there and then eventually I'll have a VODs channel I was working on that last night and then stopped <laughs> working on it so that'll happen too just because I want to be able to save the videos especially because like with this world you know it's going to be like hopefully around for a while and if people want to see like where it started they could do that I think it was down here I saw it from the boat over here all right I'm getting... Alright, uh, hold on. I should respond... ...to this... Uh, I'll probably be streaming... ...a little bit longer. I won't go over, like... ...two and a half hours, so it's, like, 10.30 now. So I'll be done by, like, 11... Okay. Um... This is a scary place. There's light there. There's a drowned here. It's getting dark. Okay, actually, hold on. We'll come back to this when it's not nighttime because I'm just gonna get swarmed by these dudes. Oh, the axolotls will probably spawn more at night than in the day. Because I mean, as far as I know, their spawn criteria is they spawn. Oh, this was the first cave we were in, by the way. They spawn in the dark. And in water because they need water to like live <laughs> you know as little fishy dudes do they last longer above water than other things i think it's like 15 minutes i want to say above water if i remember it yes i totally was <laughs> looking this up earlier because i was like these guys are adorable uh yeah that they they like the water when I get a lot of them and have a little ha when I get a lot of them and have a little habitat for them it will be underwater or in the water I guess a little aquarium type thing for them okay what was I doing? sleeping in the bed that's why I came here all right Now we look for axolotls. All the under, all of the under. Ooh, dolphin! Give me speed. Dolphins, great.